gonna go, Jess is gonna see what they want. Ooh, my window's dirty. We're gonna see what he wants for that. You want one of those? Well, the story was, is, I mean, I just sold my Miata yesterday, and the, and the plan was to put it in the Mustang and the Honda. If it's, if it's too good to pass up, I gotta possibly jump on it. I've always wanted one. We will see. That'd be a cool hauler for the dirt bikes, you know? It's, it's fairly used. I'm assuming it's low kilometers, but still, it's for pushing snow. It comes with a blade. And it's a four-wheel drive, five-speed. It's right-hand drive, which I thought was cool. We're now in the Honda. Can go check out that that Honda that key Honda. truck, possibly. This is honestly one of the quietest cars I've ever owned, besides a Buick. Dude, we're doing 105. We're gonna peg this thing out. Oh, we're hitting boost. Oh, B Tech, B Tech. <laughs> Yeah, it's just a broken speedometer. We're doing like 50. That's another project. So much for $900, right? Might be a rest-free uh, rest coupe, but it's gonna keep me busy with all the little projects. Here it is. All right, walk us around it, Justice. Steve's. This looks like a late 80s Honda. I think they call them Acties. Oh my gosh. This looks cleaner than the, uh, I think the Suzuki was like an O3. Here, it was slick. But look at these, these bicycle tires. What are those? 12, 145 R12, that's what they say. But this thing's Pretty clean. Look at this straw exhaust. I have a bigger straw for my chocolate milk. That thing is, it's got, it looks like 72,000 kilometers on the clock. Yeah, that's about 30. Slam project. I don't think it, it's a, not a four wheel drive, but 4,900. And like I said, I said it was a late 80s, and it was a, it's actually an 88 Honda Acti, I think. He never said it, he just knew it was a Honda. Which, it's, it is hard to find the Hondas. It'd kind of be cool to like have the family Hondas. And especially putting a CRF 450 in the back of one of those. Driving around to cool uh, uh, ride sites and whatnot, but. For 4900 I mean, I just sold my Miata for way less than that. I'd rather have the Miata back, so. I'll have to find, we're, we're actually gonna cruise uh, Lexington to see if there's any other like sweet deals. I know this, this place is known for having Hondas everywhere, but we'll see if there's any irresistible things to find. All right, we've just found another key truck just parked around. It's, it's a been Subaru. About 10 minutes and we, we find another one. We weren't even looking for it, really. We just saw a bunch of cars, so we came up and looked. It's pretty beat. We're gonna go ask them what they want for it. It's, it's not exactly nice. But it's right across the road, there's a silver one sitting right there. So we're gonna go in and ask them. Show them the race car. Heck yes. Pretty clean. It, the car is not for sale, so I, I would like try to impersonate, but my Spanish is a little no, no es for sale. <laughs> but, <laughs> that's that's all I got. So no luck on that. And the one across the street, I'm pretty sure it was the guy that was working there. He just he just happened to be really cool to own one of those. But it, it's still really cool to find those kind of cars around, but not being for sale. It's... Alrighty. Just got back into Carney and we're gonna go get some food. And then we got the hookup to check out. We got the hookup uh, for uh, drugs. I mean, some. I think we know a person that has a couple brand new blow off valves 
And of course, I'm only looking for one for this. So, I think he also has an intercooler. I don't. I think it might be too big for this, but we're gonna go check it out. He's. I think he's got a decent price on him. So, um, after some foods, some BK, and some Chinese for this kid, because he's so JDM, right? That makes sense. Well, that was us. He's still eating. Burger, no bun. Save those carbs for a uh, cake or something. Weight reduction. Mmm. We're just still waiting for that, that blow off valve guy, Gavin. I think he'd be real offended if we called him that. We'll be back once. Once we go hit him up. We're just sitting around waiting for Gavin so we can go see the blow off valve. We still have about an hour. So we get yesterday, oh that's way too far. The, the guy who bought Justice's Miata, as you know Christian, he sends us this message. He's driving the Miata back and this is what happened to him. I don't even know. I don't even know. Drive drifting. Let me know. Oh, oh my God. God. <laughs> <laughs> Drive back. Man. Burnout, do burnout. <laughs> <laughs> My patches are so bad. Okay, well, we came over to Gavin's. This is the first time seeing him in a vlog. I'm filming on my phone because <laughs> <laughs> my camera died. So, just bought this. I don't think that's the noise this makes. You want to spin it for the vlog? Do it. Alright, we're gonna do the break dancing kitty. For anybody? <laughs> Drift kitty. Thanks, Gavin. Thanks, <laughs> Gavin. <You're> There's really <laughs> we're just driving around right now. End it with the cruise. Yeah, yeah, that's pretty much what we're doing. So you can follow me. I don't care. I'm not the star of this show, but his Instagram will be in the description.